The world's natural and cultural heritages are threatened by natural disasters, climate change, and human activities. That is why technologies like spatial data are becoming more important in monitoring and conserving more than 1,000 such sites in nearly 170 countries. And now. International Center on Space Technologies for Natural and Cultural Heritage, under the auspices of UNESCO, has signed a memorandum of understanding with the International Union for Conservation of Nature, or IUCN. A channel for knowledge exchange and significant learning opportunities will open between our organization. Together. They would improve geospatial and Earth observation capacities by assessing radar, plane, and satellite imageries provided by Chinese scientists. This collaboration will strengthen IUCN science and our reputation as a global standard setter for the collection, assessment, and analysis of biodiversity-related data. It will really improve our spatial data on natural world heritage sites. This is a long-term challenge for us, and we're so pleased to see it being addressed. This, according to IUCN, will become functional starting before this September. In the monitoring of World Heritage sites, we'll generate a great deal of data and transmit them into information. From them, we'll see changes and ask why these take place and what are the trends. These are IUCN scientists' need, and through our research, I believe we'll constantly provide analysis results one after another for the conservation of UNESCO World Heritage sites and decision making at national level. According to the organizations, their cooperation in the next five years will be crucial. They will join hands to further contribute to the observation and conservation of the world heritages.